What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. All right, folks. Today we're going to talk about, uh, well, you, you, you see the picture. You know who I am, and you definitely know what I do. You know, follow me on all the social media, especially go to my Instagram, go to my Twitter down there at the bottom left, go to my uh, various YouTube channels, and I'm releasing this one on the, on the Red Herring channel, so it's all released. I do most of my podcasts on Red Herring, and today I want to talk about something that uh, kind of disturbs me. There we go. I'm going to talk about this buffoonery, this coonery, this samboism of Happy Father's Day to all you mothers. Now... Hallmark has a, a series of ethnic lines. I think they have one. Well, uh, they have a Hispanic one. They have a black one. And I'm not sure if that age when I got checked that out. I think they do. But uh, this is Hallmark, so don't be fooled by it. And the Hallmark obviously says mahogany. So when they use the code words like this, you know they're talking about black people. But uh, this is the this has become a new trend among single mothers. And if you notice, it, first of all, they, I'm, I, well, they targeted towards black people, and I'm going to get into that. The new trend of single mothers is the bitter single mothers. Let me say, let me, let me say this first. This is the bitter, bitter single mothers. Shout out to all the single mothers who are holding their, holding their heads up and doing their job 24-7, 365, who are holding the fort down and they're about their business. I shout them out all the time. Cars like these are for single mothers who are bitter, now, I blame, in a situation like this, I blame both parents. But this card is directed towards you, lady, so I have to go in on you right now. I'm not worried about the daddy who's a piece of shit right now. I'm not worried about the daddy who left you right now. That's not what we're talking about. I know a lot of you won't get the point of this video because you're too ignorant to see through that. I'm talking about right now the ignorance of what you're doing right now. Now, these cards, Hallmark, and I got to give Hallmark credit. I salute them for that one. This is some slick shit right here. They're... they're, they're they're, they're, they're targeting single mothers with these cards. And, and let's face it, single mothers are, there's a lot of single mothers who are doing this fuckery. Because, and let's, I mean, honestly, is this, is this being real? I mean, you, you are that much of an attention whore that you need to celebrate your day. You are getting Mother's Day. Well, I'm a mother and a father. No, you're not. And a lot of you are, are Bible thumpers or religious thumpers. And in your religion, it says it takes two parents. You can't be two parents. It's, it's mathematically impossible. There's things in life that aren't mathematically impossible. That and the Cleveland Browns winning the, the Super Bowl are mathematically impossible as of right now. Until you can, unless you get a, you can even get a surgery and change yourself to a man, you still couldn't be a woman at the same time. Maybe unless if you're a hermaphrodite, but you still couldn't have sex with yourself. Although you can't have sex with yourself for trying to fuck other people. But back to the lecture at hand. Hallmark is portraying on the ignorance and stupidity of the black community. And the black community accepts this shit because you want to know why? Somebody's, somebody got to do it and they're making money. And a lot of us won't call this buffoonery out because this, this, this card promotes a culture of we don't care about families. We don't care about nothing. This card, this card this, I mean, people say, oh, you're making too much of a big deal. No, I'm not, because this card is a symbol of the struggle that's going on right now. It's the symbol of the, it's not, this ain't the symbol of the black family. This is a stereotypical card right here saying all, all the black people, all they do is make kids and have babies around welfare. Well, if that's what you believe in, that's why you buy go buy this card. I don't care. Look, I have nothing personal against Hallmark. Hallmark's a business. And the job of a business is to stay in business. But I do have a problem with whenever they try to exploit ignorance and stupidity. And I have a bigger problem with the people who go for this ignorance and stupidity. Look, I'm going to catch y'all because I know there's females that I know that do this. It's, this is, this is, you're fucked up if you do this because you're, you're, you're confusing the kid. Like I said, if you have a problem with the kid's father, that's between you two. And I'm not dealing with, I'm not dealing because you picked some loser. And now all of a sudden you feel so jaded and bitter that you got to do this to try to get back at him. Which is most of the times what this is. But what it is, is you, the problem is you want to be so much of an attention whores. And I don't mean whores as in you're sleeping around. I mean you're attention whores that you're looking for attention anywhere. And this is a sign of one of these chicks. And, and, and let me tell you, these are where these in, the sensitive grown men are coming from. So when you see I don't want to deal with some of y'all grown men. This is because your mothers are influencing you. And, and you act like this. And I just don't want to deal with it. But what it is, 
a lot of these chicks are just bitter and they just you know they want they just want somebody to say something to them. They want they want to be recognized. Now this is this is the this is the fact this is the problem whenever we started having the government introducing welfare and and, and, and everybody knows what happened after that. But now you, you just want attention. Like I said, on Mother's Day, I, look me personally, I don't I don't ask for no Father's Day card on Mother's Day. Me personally, I don't like I said if I, if I have a chick. That celebrates this. I don't have a chick, but if I did and she did, she wouldn't be my chick. Cause that's I'm not dealing with this ignorance. And everybody's gonna say, "Well, and we mother gotta do this." Look, at the end of the day, you decide to put them shoes on. If you didn't want to put them shoes on, don't lace them up. This car promotes so much ignorance; it's it's, it's unbearable. That and, I, and and look at look at the price up two dollars. It's catered for black people because you guys can. Cash in your EBT card, and withdraw twenty bucks. Get yourself a King Cobra or still reserve, and you still have enough money to get one of these cards. So it's just to me, it's the ignorance is palatable. It's like a lot of these chicks are just hijacking this holiday because they're not, but they're not getting the attention today, and a lot of them are just bitter about how they how the situation turned out with them and old boy. Like I said, I'm not dealing with that situation. I'm dealing with you right now. I if you look at all my videos on all my channels, I rarely go in. Like maybe I say maybe. Five to ten percent of my videos were catered towards women where I'm going in on them. Most of my videos, as you guys know, are either newsworthy that I think that you should know, or they're about how men need need to buck up. But today, the ladies need to buck up, but they won't. You want to know why? It's this liberalism that's got to your heads. And let me tell you something: it's that white liberal feminism that got to your heads. And what and the killer part is the feminism that got to your heads. They left y'all on off the fence. They, they, I mean. How do I want to say this? They deserted you guys in feminism. While they stand by their man, you desert your man. So, so who played who? They played you. So, I'm just saying, if 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 you're a chick to celebrate this, it's it's kind of it's low class shit to me. It's just low class. Your ass is just low class. So, I'm out of here. I just wanted to do a video on this because people ask me to do a video on it. But like I said, if you celebrate this bullshit, you're low class to me. So, I'm out. Peace.